So it's now August, which means it's time for yet another TBR video, but this is not going to be your typical TBR video. Today, my husband is going to be picking my reads for me, and he has no idea what books I want to read and don't want to read. So this should be pretty interesting. Let's get into it. Hey guys, it's Tiff, and welcome back to my channel. You already know what today's video is, so I do not need to tell you twice. What is up? This is Makai. <laughs> Okay, anyways, this is my husband, Makai. Say hi. Hi, I'm Makai, her husband. <laughs> so basically how we're gonna do this is I'm going to leave the room and he's gonna take my camera around the bedroom with him, vlog style, if you will. He's gonna pick out six books for me to read. I have already flipped around all of the books that I've already read, so he doesn't pick any of those. And while he's showing you guys what he's picking i'm gonna be talking to you guys about what books i hope he does pick and what books i hope he doesn't pick that is how we're gonna do this and then when he's done he's gonna come get me we're gonna come back in here and we're gonna go through the books he's picked and go over what they are and all that kind of fun jazz so that is how we're doing this so let's go let's go on the count of three one two three let's go oh i i meant for you to say let's go with oh, me okay okay on the count of three one two three let's, let's go, go. <laughs> Let's, let's go. go. Okay, let's, okay. let's do it. Here's the vlog tip coming at ya. Obviously, I have to pick a Harry Potter book. I'm kind of hoping he doesn't choose a Harry Potter book. Because I bought these and they're super expensive. Oh, she already started this one. As much as I want to read them, I'm literally trying to save them for the fall time. Picking it anyway. Because that is the best time to read them, in my opinion. So I really don't want to read those until like September, October, November time. Let you guys see the cover. Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets, book one. This is going to take longer than I anticipated. It's not summer without you. I feel like she wants me to pick this one, so I'm going to pick this one. This is going to be such a weird reading month. She likes Colleen Hoover, and this one is suspiciously placed with a Harry Potter book thing. It's so dark. Book number three. Three more to go. Could have swore she already read this one. She definitely read this one. She's bad at turning over books. Ah, uh, yes. The fame show, The Empire Diaries. She loves it. It's a pretty good show. Book number four. Two more to go. I have to. I have a feeling he's going to choose one of his Avatar books, and I'm assuming he's going to choose the first Kiyoshi book for me to read. Choosing the Avatar book, it's a really good book. I'm just guessing he's going to pick that. We shall see. I can't do it vlog style. I'm doing it this way. Rise of Kiyoshi. It's a good book. I read it, you know, because I'm an avid reader. It's book five, one more book. Getting on into books I really hope he chooses. I really want to read Love on the Brain by Allie Hazelwood. Let me come over and look at these ones. I read The Love Hypothesis like in June, I think, and absolutely loved it. Five stars, it was so sweet. And I'm just really in the mood to read another book by her. So I'm really hoping he chooses Love on the Brain. I could have sworn we had like a million books. And then the second book I'm like absolutely dying to read is Daisy Hates by Jessa Hastings, which is the second in the Magnolia Park series. This one, I won't this one. Don't really want to read a thriller or like a mystery thriller right now because I just literally read one. Last book. Six books down. Oh, that's why I was zoomed in. She's not gonna like that. I'm kind of hoping he doesn't choose a Harry Potter book because we're going back. She doesn't want to read a Harry Potter book. It's going right back there. You done? Okay, we're we're back, and apparently he wants to give me them one by one. So I don't know what he's picked. So we're just gonna go one by one, I guess. He has literally one I in guess. his shirt, huh? I guess. I guess. Okay, book one. Yes. I'm halfway yes. through that. Well, you didn't tell me it and it was face up. That's okay, so. I'll finish it. I might just have you pick one more since I am like halfway through this. So you know what? That's fine though. It's fine. Why? It's fine. Did you pick a giant one? No. She loves it. It's a pretty good show. Keep on going, you okay. know? Okay. So the first book he chose is It's Not Summer Without You by Jenny Han, which is the second in the Summer I Turn Pretty trilogy. I'm actually like, maybe not fully halfway through this, but I am a little bit through this. I think I got to page like 100 and something. So I've already read part of this. I guess I'll be finished finishing it this month, which isn't a bad thing because I was wanting to finish this before I watched season two, so I haven't watched season two at all. So not a bad thing. I'm literally not in the mood for a summer book, so this is gonna be interesting. So that's the first book. I think we all know what this is about, so I'm not gonna go into much detail about this. Don't worry, I went into very, very much. 
Did you actually? Yeah. Okay, you can get book two. When you're editing, you're like, oh my goodness, this guy's like a book connoisseur. A book connoisseur? I don't think that's the way to word that. The two books I was telling y'all I really wanted to read are still what on my shelves. Books? We'll get into that later. All right, you can give me the next one. I'm guessing, I know for a fact you picked at least one of your Avatar books. <laughs> I'm so dead. I don't know if I said this on camera, but I did not want to read this. Wow. Like, I just don't want to read it yet, but Sweet. I guess we're reading it. Yeah, so, two books in there, so. There is, oh, this is, that's why you were like, it's okay. Okay, so the next book that's technically two books is The Vampire Diaries. So this has the first and second one in it. So The Awakening and The Struggle are the two first books in the series. I have heard a lot of people say that the books actually suck compared to the show, but I'm still intrigued and I still really wanted to read the books because I love the show so much. If you haven't seen the show, just please watch the show. Like, it's so good. Team Damon, Till the Day I die if your team Stefan just leave she loves I'm just kidding suckers. I'm just what them big Oprah Oprah suckers <laughs> <laughs> what well if you would have told me what books were at least interesting I didn't want to though I wanted it to be completely like random what you were choosing ow that's one of the avatar Ooh, books <laughs> yes I can tell by the look on your face. You picked both of the Kiyoshi books, didn't you? Stop looking! <laughs> you, I know what you picked. Oh, okay. I knew, I literally told them that I knew you were gonna pick this. I heard. You heard me talking? Yeah, I was going downstairs and I was like, came up here and actually put back a book because you said you didn't want to read it. Which one did you put back? Uh, a Harry see. Potter? I heard you say Harry Potter when you opened the door. So that's what you put back. You'll see. That's what you put back. Okay, I literally told y'all he was gonna have me read this. Next book is The Rise of Kiyoshi by FC Yee? Is that how you say that? Yee? 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 Okay. <laughs> Anyways, this is a Avatar The Last Airbender book. If you haven't seen that show, very good. We love it in this household. He's read both of them. He really, really liked them. So I guess I will be reading the first one. I hate hardcovers. So this is going to be annoying to I read, to be honest. I think the book is better. I feel like that's a running theme with like series. It's like the second one is typically always this better. This book is good, but I think the second one is better. So that is the second book. Here, here she is. I'm, actually, this is the third book. What am I saying? Anyways. Math. One, three, two. Yeah, that's how, that's how math works. I am kind of glad I only had him choose six though because that gives me a little bit of wiggle room to potentially read the two books I wanted to read also, since he didn't pick them. So pick two more. Pick two more. Is what I'm That's doing. not what I said. I might have All you right. pick, I might have you pick another one at the end. I'm picking two right now. No, where? I'm picking two right now. Right now. Right now. Right now. Yep. That, why is that like what that? What are you talking to me out? Meow. No, they're not even over here. One's over there and one's over there. The I'll tell you the color of each cover. The color over there is pink. The cover over there is, oh, that's going to be kind of obvious, but it's yellow. <laughs> Daisy yeah. This is low-key cheating, but that's okay. I honestly don't care. I really want to read it. <laughs> There's guns on the cover. Yeah. And Jesus and, what the fuck is this? It's the second in the Magnolia Park series. Yeah. Okay, <laughs> this is low-key cheating, but it's okay because this is my video and I can do what I want. Relax. FYI, I'm going to make an entire video over the course of this month of me reading hopefully every single one of these. I'm going to try to stick 100% to this TBR, but I'm a mood reader, so that's going to be a little there tricky. He just added the two I wanted to read to the list. So we have Love on the Brain by Allie Hazelwood. I actually don't know what this one is about. I really wanted to read another one of her books because they're just such fun, wholesome, sweet love stories. So I'm very excited to read this. And then of course, course. Y'all already know Daisy Hates by Jessa Hastings, the second in the Magnolia Park series. Also, do you see how big this book is? I ordered the last three off Amazon. I've literally said this on my channel, but if you haven't heard me say this, they literally sent the last two, the regular size, which is the same size as my first one. And then they sent me the UK size, which is giant of this one. And it's literally irritating to my soul, but that's okay. So I'm just so excited to continue this series. I have been really itching to pick this up since it got delivered. So I am very excited to read this. I want to read it literally right now, but that's just not going to happen. Anyways, what is the fourth do you book? Do you even remember what you put in there? Never Never by Colleen Hoover. You're looking and you're cheating. Well, how else am I supposed to guess? By not looking. Okay, just, sorry. Just, just, just what's on my mind. So I was right. I'm not mad about this. I haven't read a Colleen Hoover book since I finished It Starts With Us. I know she's kind of controversial. You either love her or you literally she's hate her. So that's the next book. Oh. We're just gonna sit here and act awkward because 
I'm not mad about this. I actually literally was just looking at these like three days ago being like, hmm, I should read these soon. This is the first, I think it's a duology. It's the Grimrose Girls by Lara Pohl. Oh, I don't know how to say that. Anyways. Can I make a switch? A switch? Give me the Colleen Hoover book. You don't want to, you don't want. Yeah, I'm switching it. Okay. We're revoking Never Never. Anyways, uh, The Grimrose Girls by Laura Paul. This is about four girls who go to boarding school together and there's a murder and then they end up starting to investigate and realize that the boarding school has a dark secret. And that girl who was murdered was not the first girl to die. The past murders at this boarding school are linked to an ancient fairy tale and they have to figure out how to break the cycle before, you know, it kind of catches up to them. So yeah, this is the first. I'm pretty sure it's just a duology, but I could be wrong. I do own both of them. So if I love this one enough, you know, we'll just read the second one next month. But I'm actually kind of excited about this. I'm, I mean, I wasn't wanting any of these books except the two you added because I wanted wow. to read them, but I'm kind of getting excited to read them. I'm actually really excited getting about excited this one. to read them? Yeah. Even the Kyoshi book? Yeah. Well, that's good news for you because I just swapped out the Colleen Hoover one for the second one. Okay, so I guess I'm reading both <laughs> Kiyoshi books. Um, all right, why did you decide to do that? Explain to the people. Because you can't read one book and then not read the other. Okay, you well. read them back to back like you're watching a Marvel. Just sequence. it books in general or for these in particular? I don't know, I just wanted you to read both. Okay. Because you thought I was going to pick two Avatar books, so I was like, you know what? Yeah, why but not? I know the Yang Chen book is over there. Do you know that for 100% Yes, because sure? it's not over here. You know that for 100% fact. Quit looking! Anyways, I guess instead of Never Never, we're doing The Shadows of Kiyoshi, which is the second in the duology of the Kiyoshi series. So, that is switched out I guess that was very last minute this video is kind of all over the place hope you guys are still liking it though go grab Probably the other not. one wow you don't think they're enjoying I don't it I want to look at my ugly mug you're not ugly <laughs> I know it's the Yang Chen book are you sure about yes, that yes I'm like dead ass I'm, I'm like pretty f sure oh the, where is where the Yang Chen oh that's downstairs because you're still reading that anyway so the last book you picked is Travis by Mia Sheridan this is the second to Archer's voice this is supposed to be Travis's redemption story I have obviously yet to get to this but I have been wanting to because he is such an asshole in the what am I saying I was about to say in the movie he is such an and Archer's voice so I've been wanting to read this and figure out like is he really gonna get redemption I mean I've heard good things about this book and I did really enjoy Archer's voice so I'm not too mad about this this is definitely not what I was expecting you to pick like why did you pick this did you even know this was the second to what one, one of I've already course read I did you will see it in the video don't lie you'll see it in the video when you're editing it I was like I know all about this book yeah so I'm putting it in there yeah sure anyways so I guess that is the last book he picked so this is definitely gonna be like I I, would, I, I will say though, I really didn't want to read a mystery thriller because I just wasn't feeling that vibe. So yeah, yeah, I don't want to get scared on the, about those words on the page. <laughs> You're an So this is our stack of books for the month of August. Just to reiterate what we're reading, we have The Grimrose Girls, Travis by Mia Sheridan, Daisy Hates by Jessa Hastings, Love on the Brain by Allie Hazelwood, The Rise of Kiyoshi, and The Shadows of Kiyoshi by F.C. Yi, or Ye, I don't know how to say it, The Vampire Diaries, the first two, which is The Awakening and The Struggle by L.J. Smith, and I will be finishing It's Not Summer Without You by Jenny Han. What so, are you going to read them in? I don't know. I feel like I should probably finish this one first mm -hmm. since I'm halfway through it. Are you wanting to pick the order? No, I'm just curious. I'm such a mood reader that I think I'm just gonna have to like pick on the fly, you know? Like I'll finish this and then whatever I'm feeling like reading next I'll grab. So these three are gonna be last. Not necessarily. Yeah. You don't yes, know that for are. a fact. I might honestly read this second because I'm actually am kind of excited to read this and it's been on my TBR for a fat minute. So, so yeah, that is my August TBR. Thank you to Makai you for know coming what? along. You should rename it. TRL. What is that? Tiffany's reading list. Tiffany's reading list. This is Tiffany's reading list for August. My TRL. <laughs> That's a new thing now. We're making it a thing. Right Get here, right now. Get this video to 10 million likes and we'll start reviewing book movies together. That is a lot of likes. Holy sh**. My whole channel in total doesn't even have a million views. And you okay. Like Give this video to 5k likes and we'll start reviewing movie books together. Movie books? Movie books. Books that became movies. I'll pick it apart because I'm not going to read it and then she'll judge it based on the book. Give it a like! Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give Dislike. it a- Dislike. Don't comment. No. Unsubscribe. No. Don't no. Don't no. forget to give it a Make thumbs sure up. Make sure you mute the channel, block it. <laughs> no. Report her Instagram. <laughs> don't forget to- <laughs> 
anyways don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you're not already because we have a lot of fun over here and we want you to join the fun <laughs> with that being said i love you guys so so much and i'll see you in the next one peace what is that bunch of hearts it's a bunch of hearts you see it? yeah do you see mine what the fuck is that wow rude no it looks like you're trying to fucking squeeze somebody's brain <sighs> okay on your head oh yeah i'm That's trying good. to squeeze my own brain then you should be like <laughs> <laughs> goodbye shelves i flipped around all of the books that i were you just flipping <laughs> off me <laughs> you have to do it more i look like a shadow What are you doing? I don't know. <laughs> That's the face you want to make? <laughs> Can you be serious for like two seconds? What am I supposed to do? I'm just holding the book. Yeah, but you need to pose and don't go. <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> Wait, maybe you should act like you're handing them to me. Act like, okay, no, <laughs> not like that. Stop pushing it. <laughs> Please let me go. <laughs> Give her the books. <laughs> Give her the books. I'm doing everything you do. God damn. I don't feel like I do. Got to. Ah! <laughs> you have to be right next to me. No, face the camera. You know what I I'm mean. Makai. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're not looking all stupid, Liam. <laughs> Okay, you look a little happy, like don't look so pissed. You're a mean one. <laughs> Come on, let's start. Don't look at me for a second while I collect myself. <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, it's Tip and welcome back to my <laughs> series. What am I supposed to do? Am I just Hey guys. Hey guys. <laughs> You already know what time it is. No. That's... You already know what this video is. No, but you still you guys miss know something. What this is. <laughs> <laughs> no, you're not. I'm just sitting here. <laughs> Stop. Oh, that's not what I meant. <laughs> Help me. Ah, how are you Do you need life saving measures? Yes.